So the question that you must be asking yourself right now is like, where in the world are we? Well, we're in Vanuatu right now, and we got here, I took some clips in Sydney of, uh, of this. Rock. It's funny, when you're walking on the boat for three, four days, and then you get off, it feels like you're still walking on the boat. So I'm walking a bit, a bit spastic at the moment, but that's okay. Because we're about to swim in the bluest water I think I've ever seen. So, so the mission was to come back here because I've been here when I was a kid, and I think I might have footage of that actually. We've got a rope swing behind us, this is going to be mint. Everyone's having a good time. There's a lot of people here though. Last time we came here it was nearly this packed. because you get up the top, it's like a piece of wood with two nails holding up against a tree. This is duct taped together. <laughs> and then, I, like, I've never done a rope swing before, like, not like this anyway, but... Oh. But you're supposed to hold on until the end, whereas... I like let go pretty much as soon as I hit the water. So I think I'm gonna practice... You gotta swing through it. I think I gotta practice on the bottom. And like, he told me to put it in between my toes. Yeah. I'm like, I'm gonna rip my toe off if I do that. Go. We are now back from that absolute madness of a day. I'm walking back through the ship and I'm actually in the casino right now, so that's kind of cool. Have a look around. All those colors. But yeah, this ship has been my home for the past couple of days. I haven't really vlogged anything because I haven't had an SD card. I left it at home. But um, I've gotten to learn a couple of new things. Uh, I've been like learning on the Flow Rider which is a pretty fun board sport. I'm gonna do a full review of that board sport shortly. Benoatu, how you doing? Absolutely awesome day, guys. Um, the story behind the Blue Lagoon is that, look at all these mirrors behind me, by the way. The story behind the Blue Lagoon is that we went there a couple years ago and it's been ages and I've, ever since I've been there I've just wanted to go back there, have a look, see if it's changed and boy has it changed. Tourism, like they've installed rope swings and people are working there now, you have to pay to get in. But yeah, I mean it was a great day overall. Now I'm going to go shred on the flow rider. And uh, yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna probably gonna be making a video on the Flow Rider, so you guys stay tuned. I'm gonna do a review on that as a board sport and how, like, why it's such a cool sport. Um, there's a bunch of different reasons, but I'll go through that tomorrow. So hopefully you guys come and check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later.